Hey y'all, Chris here. I got Will and Clifford with me. Hey y'all. And today we're talking about the prophecy of Daniel 12 and talking about how it relates to the fast of the fifth month coming next month. We're also talking about how it relates to this year specifically. So starting at this date calculation, we have that this Daniel 12 and 1 is talking about a prophecy that Daniel made back during the captivity. And he talks about 12, 1290 days, which we can translate to be as years, interpret to be as years. And he also talks about 1335 days. And so in order to see what year that is, if we were to translate those days to years, he says that this time starts when a daily sacrifice was taken away, which is at the beginning of the besiegement of Jerusalem, the holy city. When Nebuchadnezzar, king of Babylon, came to Jerusalem and started attacking, that's when this day starts. And so that was in 605 BC. It says here in Daniel 12 and 11, and from the time that the daily sacrifice shall be taken away, and the abomination that maketh desolate set up, there shall be a thousand two hundred and ninety days. So if we translate that to be years, then you take 605 BC, which would be negative 605, and add 1,290 days. That takes you to 685, but you have to add one day because there was no year zero. And that takes you to 686. And that is the date that the dome of the rock was put on top of the um. That was put on top of the temple mount. The temple mount where they had the temple and it was broken down. And there was the stone that was used as the foundation of the temple. A mount. A monument was put on top of it to cover it and keep the um, Jews from getting back to it to be at the Temple Mount again. And that cover is the abomination of desolation. And it was just sat. The temple used to sit here and they put this whole building on top of it and covered it in that same year. You can see when was it built. Six eighty nine. It says six ninety one. So they would have started building it, of course, years before, in six eighty six or so. And so that's when the abomination of desolation was put on top of the mount. And then it says, "Blessed is he that cometh, that waiteth, and cometh to the thousand three hundred five and thirty days." So we take six eighty six plus one thousand. 300, 5, 35 days, and that brings us to 2021. And now this besiegement is started in the later half of that year, like in the 10th month. But you can round it up to 2022, starting in that this event started in 2022. And the thing is, this is when the besiegement started. And it was two years after when the temple was actually broken down and burnt up. And so if you go two years after 2022, then you have 2024. Now, why is the fast of the fifth month important to that? Because here in Zechariah 8, it says that the fast of the fourth month, the fast of the fifth month, the fast of the seventh, and the fast of the tenth shall be to the house of Judah joy and gladness and cheerful feast. Now these are fasting days because like on the fast of the fifth month, this is when the temple was broken down. Or during the fast of the tenth month, this is when the besiegement started. And so the tenth month has already happened. We've already passed that date. Well, it was in 2022 when Jacob's trouble ended. That was when it was supposed to happen in 2022. And so now we're waiting on the fast of the fifth month and the fast of the seventh to be fulfilled. 
fast the fourth. I don't know much about it. And so this next fasting day that we expect something to happen will happen is expected to come next month. Because remember, the fast of the fifth month's event is what happened in next month time, two years after the fast of the tenth. So in summary, if we go through these dates that happen between Daniel, Ezekiel, 1 Kings, and Zechariah, we see that the fast of the tenth month was fulfilled in 2022, and now we're expecting the fast of the fifth month to the event to take place when the temple was destroyed in 2024 next month and we could check the calendar right quick or we can go to coachinafight.shop you can see all these pictures that we're using at coachinafight.shop if you scroll down to the gallery and we see that the fast of the fifth month is on the 10th of all August 15th see here that it says a verse here at the 7th this is when the person that came to burn the temple down came in to the temple and the 10th day is when he actually did it which will be August 15th this year if you got anything out of this video you can hit the like button if not hit the dislike button you can download these pictures at coachinafight.shop and leave a comment either way Shalawama Shalawama